Okay, guys, buckle up because Techno just dropped a serious contender. The Techno Povo 6 Pro 5G has landed at the Mobile World Congress 2024 in Barcelona, which we're covering live and the company isn't playing around. This phone is all about gaming and Techno even partnered with Farlight 84, the crazy popular battle royale game for PC and mobile devices. Kinda overkill? Maybe. But hey, we're not complaining, especially when you get the phone in a box like this with a bit of extra stuff inside. Let's be honest, the design is out there. The Technopova 6 Pro 5G has this attractive, industrial-inspired mecha design language coupled with many LEDs on the camera block. Now, some people might find it cheesy, but we love the flashy look. And we dig the many customization options in the settings app. Notifications, music, gaming, whatever. You can make these mini LEDs blink how you like. Honestly, they are a lot of fun. The Technopova 6 Pro 5G is surprisingly well built too. Plastic, but solid in all the right places. And thanks to its IP53 rating, it's even got a little splash resistance for all those sweaty handed matches. Okay, looks aside, can it actually came? Well, if you used last year's Technopova 5 Pro 5G, the chipset's the same. But here's the thing. Techno has bumped up the RAM, the cooling system is all new, and honestly, that makes quite a difference. Most games run smoothly at decent settings, and we even cranked up some demanding ones without our unit turning into a toaster. Check out these gameplay recordings and benchmarks to see how the phone handles some of our favorite apps for Android devices. It's not a flagship beast, but at this price, color is quite impressed. Speaking of impressed, the haptics are better than we expected, like you actually feel those headshots in your favorite shooter. Combine that with high-res certified dual speakers, now with Tolby Atmos tuning, and games should feel way more immersive than you might think. Plus, the AI noise cancellation and calls is secretly awesome for when you need to make or receive calls in a noisy setting like a bar or restaurant. Now here's where the Pova 6 Pro 5G wins big, the battery. Somehow, Techno managed to cram a 6,000 mAh battery despite the middle frame being slimmer this time around and measuring just 7.8 mm without the camera bump. Techno claims the Pova 6 Pro 5G should deliver at least 14 hours of video streaming or 11 hours of continuous gaming on a single charge. Given those numbers, two days should be easy on this thing, even with serious gaming sessions. And with the brand 70 watt ultra charge standard, you can forget about overnight top ups. This thing hits 100% in like an hour in hyper mode, sometimes less. Alright, let's talk screen. Finally, an AMOLED upgrade. The bezels are noticeably slimmer too, so the display looks way sleeker. It's got the smooth 120Hz refresh, and the colors are bright enough. Oh, and bless Techno for that in-screen fingerprint reader. 
Honestly, we didn't see that coming. The fingerprint sensor is reasonably fast and accurate and even works when your fingers are sweaty from intense online matches. As for the cameras, the main one with 108 megapixel is a decent tree to take, but it's mostly a basic setup. But if photos are really your main priority, you may want to check out Techno's camo lineup. So, is this the perfect smartphone? Maybe not. But as a gamer on a budget, the Techno Pova 6 Pro 5G has a number of positives going for it. That huge battery, the AMOLED screen with almost uniform bezels, the decent 5G chip, the fun design with many LEDs, this smartphone is definitely more tempting than most competing products out on the market today. If you're tired of handsets that tie mid-match or just want something unique, this could be worth checking out. Expect our full review of the Technopova 6 Pro 5G next week when the local embargo lifts.